CQ Researcher is a fantastic starting point for your research, whether you've decided on a topic or you're still trying to work one out. If you're looking for topic ideas, click on Browse Reports, where you can browse by topic, date, or other options. If we browse by topic, we can see a variety of subtopics. Reports also have a publication date and can be sorted by most recent. You can also search for specific topics, as we've done here with fracking. When doing a search, you may find more than one relevant result. Make certain to check the dates to find the most recent ones. Reports in CQ Researcher provide a large amount of background information on the topics they describe. Included in this overview are statistics and explorations of pressing concerns within the topic. The background, current situation, and outlook of the issue are explored in depth, followed by a pro-con debate from two experts in the field, as well as other features, such as a chronology. But probably one of the best features in CQ Researcher is the bibliography. In this section, you can find references to useful books, articles, reports, and websites. It's important to remember that reports in CQ Researcher can be emailed. Click on the pull-down menu that says Email a link back to, and then select Full Report. Fill in your email address and the recipient's address. This is probably you too. Then click Send Email. If the email doesn't show up in your inbox, check your junk mail. Sometimes they end up there. It's also important to be able to cite the information CQ Researcher provides. Clicking on Cite Now at the top generates a citation. You can choose the appropriate style. If you have further questions about CQ Researcher or any other stage in your research, please contact a librarian using the Ask a Librarian link on the library homepage. Thanks and good luck!